Hello everyone, this is Balu. Welcome to my channel Civil Cave. In this video, I am going to discuss about NIT's fee structure. Like here you can see the this is the CCMT 2024 website. But every year they are going to give the details of fee structure regarding each and every participating in student CCMT. But this year they didn't mention regarding the fee structure of each and every participating institute. Whatever the participating institute details here you can see the contact details whatever the in charge for each and every participating institute their details have been given in the CCMT website but the fee structure is not mentioned. So I am doing a dedicated video for the fee structure of each and every participating institute. So please watch the video till the end so that you can get the details regarding each and every participating institute. And also if you have not yet subscribed my channel, please subscribe my channel and also hit the like button and share with your friends who are participating in the CCMT counseling. Okay, let us get into the video. Why we have to know about the fee structure of NIT? Because for example, each and every NIT fee structure is different. If you consider NIT Warangal, NIT Suratkal, both fee structure is different. And one NIT is having some fee structure and some other NIT is having different fee structure and also hostel fees also vary with each and every NIT. How this NIT fee structure is distributed? Now let us know about this. Fee distribution. It is distributed into tuition fee, other fee, hostel fee, mess fee. See, tuition fee, you all know about tuition fee. Next, other fee, it includes like library fee, laboratory fee, admission fee, student welfare fee and all other fees etc. Next coming to the hostel fee, it includes room rent, electricity, water charges. Next coming to the mess fee, whatever the food you are going to consume, it is regarding the mess fee. For each and every NIT, the fee is distributed in the form of all these forms. Next if you are a day scholar, this you are exempted from the hostel fee and mess fee. Remaining fee, anyway you have to pay. Next coming to the thing is, when you are getting admitted into the college, what is the fee structure of semester 1? It includes all these things. The complete fee you have to pay in the semester 1. It includes convocation fee, all other fees in the semester fee. And semester 1 fee is very high compared to remaining semesters. Because whenever you are getting into the institute, you have to pay the caution fee and also convocation fee, all other fees will be there. So semester 1 fee will be higher. And also you will think that I can pay whenever I get that uh, stipend. No, you can't pay with the stipend because the stipend you will get after four months or maybe six months it will take in some NITs. After six months, the stipend will get credit into your accounts. So until then you have to survey with your own money. Please keep this in mind and exercise the options in the CCMT counseling. And also please go through each and every NIT fee structure once and keep the options carefully. Okay, if you have enough money, there is no problem. But few people have to check whether the fee is whatever the fee they are going to keep is okay for me. Okay, I can pay that amount. Then only you can keep that option in the web options. Okay, now let us get into the whatever the fee structure details of NIT. Here you can see. I have mentioned each and every NIT, almost all NITs are there. It includes 10 NITs. Remaining NITs, please uh, go through the internet and search for the details of the fee structure. Whatever the top NITs I have mentioned here the regarding the fee structure. Okay, here you can see NIT Warangal. This is the college fee and this is the hostel fee. And rem remember for SCST candidates, tuition fee is exempted. Okay, please keep this in mind. Next, coming to the NIT Trichy, this is the fee structure. Okay, you have to pay both college fee and also hostel fee. For example, if you take NIT Varangal, 76,000 plus 46,460 rupees, whatever the total amount you get, you have to pay in the semester one fee. Please keep this in mind. It is almost greater than 1 lakh. Next, coming to the Suratkal, this is the fee structure and also NIT Rurkela also here details are given, but this Rurkela fee structure is including the hostel fee. That is 89,000 you have to pay if you are belong to open category and you want to take admission in the hostel, then you have to pay 89,000 rupees. Next coming to the Surat, here this is the fee structure details. Next coming to the Kurukshetra, Calicut, Allahabad, all details I have given. And coming to the Durgapur, this is the fee structure, but it is excluding the mess fee. 
Hostel fee it is included in this 80,600, but mess fee is not given in the that PDF. So I have not mentioned regarding this mess fee. Almost like like 25,000 will be there roughly. So if you add 25,000, 1 lakh 5,600 rupees will be the fee college fee for the NIT Durgapur if you belongs to open category students. And please keep in mind whatever the course may be, it may be structural engineering, it may be VLSI design, any course, the fee structure remains constant for each and every MTech course. Please keep this in mind. And also this is regarding the fee structure details. And if you want some other colleges details, please search in the Google, you can easily find out. For example, I will show one college. I am taking new tab, here I am typing NIT Varangal MTech fee structure for academic year 2024 to 2025. See here I am getting the PDF. This is the MTech fee structure for the academic year 2023 to 24 and 2024 to 25 also. Here you can see the first semester details clearly given. So similarly you keep searching for the other NIT's fee structure details also. Okay. Thank you for watching this video. If you have not yet subscribed my channel, please subscribe my channel and also hit the like button and share with your friends who are participating in the CCMT counseling. Thank you.